I know you're searching for a way to work from home online, but you feel lost jumping from one video to another, and I promise you, after this video, you will have the ability to start an online business from one of the best types of businesses right now and in the future, selling digital products. But I know what you're about to ask me. How am I going to design these digital products? And the answer is simple. My channel is full of detailed videos that explain exactly how to design digital products step by step. I specialize in designing and selling digital products, so go in, watch for yourself, and see the proof. And I already know your next question. Where will I sell these products? I'll tell you briefly. There are many platforms like Amazon and Etsy, and you can also create your own website so you avoid account shutdown problems, whether on Etsy or on Amazon. Then your next question will be, where do I build my website? The answer is very simple. You can create your website on Shopify, or on WordPress, or on System.io. And today, we're going to explain the System platform. System is a platform that allows you to sell digital products, and it has a completely free plan. Yes, it won't cost you anything. It's an amazing platform for both beginners and professionals alike. And now, let's jump straight into the actual steps of selling digital products on the System.io platform. There are three main steps to selling your digital products. The first step is designing the digital product itself. And just like I told you before, my channel is full of videos focused exactly on this part. Just go in, watch, and design along with me. In this video, we'll be using a product we designed together a few days ago, which is a kid's coloring book. I'll show you exactly how to sell it on the System.io platform step by step. The second step is getting a professional domain name so your brand name appears clearly and makes your audience immediately recognize that you are selling real products. And I always recommend one thing. If you're going to sell anything online, choose a .store domain. So why choose a .store domain in the first place? Simple. .store was built specifically for online selling. It's not just a domain name, it's a clear signal that instantly tells customers this is a place to shop. And this isn't just marketing hype. A detailed study shows that websites using a .store domain receive 87% more traffic and rank twice as high on Google because both users and search engines immediately recognize the site as an online store. That's exactly why over 1.5 million sellers already trust Dot Store, including massive brands like Mr. Beast, Cristiano Ronaldo, Rihanna, and Emirates Airlines. It's the ideal domain for selling anything online and one that genuinely helps you sell more. And right now, for a limited time, you can grab your Dot Store domain for just 99 cents using my exclusive coupon code MINC through the link in the description. Plus, when you buy a dot .store domain, you unlock Elevate.store, a completely free, curated toolkit for online sellers, packed with exclusive deals on powerful tools like Canva, Shopify, AutoDS, and more. It's available to everyone, but dot .store owners get the biggest discounts, and the best part? It's all included at no extra cost. When customers see a dot .store domain, they instantly know it's an online shop. And that clarity is exactly how you sell more with dot .store. The third step is uploading your digital product to the System.io platform. You'll find all the website links we used down in the description below this video. First, we'll open the System platform, and very easily, just like I told you before, it's a free platform and it does not ask for your credit card details to get started, so you can begin with zero pressure. Simply enter my email address, then after that it will ask for your mobile number. You'll enter it, confirm it, and within seconds the platform will open exactly like this. Now we'll head over to the settings section so we can set everything up properly. Here inside your profile settings, you can edit and adjust them at any time. Then, if we go to My Plan, you'll see there are paid plans available. I want you to compare them carefully, and I personally recommend that once you start making sales, 
you upgrade to one of these plans. But in the beginning, you can start completely free. Next, if we go to the Payment Methods section, this is where you'll choose how you receive your money when someone buys your product. You can receive payments through Stripe, through PayPal, and many other different payment methods. Now here, if we go to the Custom Domain section, you'll notice that the platform automatically creates a domain for you using the same name as the email you registered with. But this is not a professional domain because it ends with .system.io. That's why I strongly recommend you buy a .store domain and then connect it to your website by clicking Add Domain and entering your domain name. Here, the platform will give you the DNS information that you'll connect inside your domain page on get.store. And if you don't know how to connect it, don't worry at all. Just follow the steps provided on that page and you'll connect it very easily. Now, if we go back to the main dashboard so we can upload our product, all we need to do is go to Sites, then click on Sales Funnel, and after that, click the Create button. Here, we'll write the name of the page or the website we want to create. I'll write, for example, the book name, Cozy Coloring Book. After that, I'll click on the option Sell, and here I'll choose the currency I want to sell the book with. I personally always prefer the US dollar instead of the Euro. Then I'll click on Save. Now, the platform automatically creates the funnel for us. All I need to do now is click on it and you'll notice that System.io automatically created two pages for you. One page is called the order form, and the other one is called the thank you page. We'll go into the details of these pages later during the video. Now, what we want to do is create a page to upload our digital product. So I'll scroll down and click on Add Step. I'll name this page the same name as the book, and I'll choose this page to be a sales page. And within one second, the platform will create this page and add it to the two pages that already exist. Just like that, your sales funnel structure is ready to continue building and selling your digital product. All we need to do now is choose one of these sales page templates to become the front-facing product page for our digital product. There are so many different templates available, and you can simply browse through them and pick the one that fits the type of digital product you're selling. For example, I can see that this page works really well for selling ebooks. Let's look at it together. Yes, it's excellent for ebooks, but I don't think it's suitable for kids' products. So I'll go back again and choose another page. I'll select this page right here. I see that it's perfect for selling a kid's coloring book, so I'll go ahead and choose this template. Now, let's move on and start editing it. All I need to do is click on the Edit Page button. At this point, this becomes your website, and you can modify anything inside it very easily. One of the best features of System.io is that editing is extremely simple and doesn't require any experience at all. For example, if I want to delete the top bar, all I have to do is click the delete icon and it's instantly removed. Now, let's say I want to replace this image with an image of my own product. I'll click on the image, then go to the panel on the left side of the screen and upload the coloring book image right here. And within one second, the product image replaces the old one. We can also customize this image further. For example, we can make it smaller, make it bigger, or even move it to the left side of the page. This is especially useful if you want to add text next to your book cover image and design the page exactly the way you want. And we can also edit the text that appears below the image. Let's write the coloring book title right here. And the text under the title is perfect for writing a detailed description of the book. I've already taught you this before in a long, detailed video. I'll leave it for you linked below this video where I show you how to design a full book, write a strong title, create a professional description, and even design your own images and buttons. Here, you can also change the text colors very easily, so your website looks more attractive and visually appealing. Now, if we scroll down a little, you'll see these buttons right here. For example, I want to delete the button on the right side. All I need to do is click the delete icon and it's gone instantly. Then I'll drag the remaining button and place it right in the center of the page. And this will be our buy button. Now, if we click on the button and go to the panel on the left side, you'll see several options. 
One option is submit form, which means when someone clicks the button, a form appears for them to fill out, and then you manually contact them and send the book. I don't find this option suitable. The second option is open URL, and this is the best option for us. Because after we finish this page, we'll create a checkout page and connect it to this button. So when the buyer clicks this button, it will take them directly to the payment page to complete the purchase. After payment, we'll redirect them to the download page where they can get the book instantly. And if we scroll down a little more, we can also change the text on this button. For example, we can write buy now. I want you to understand something important. You can change anything on this website exactly the way you like. You can adjust the button size, the button height, and many other details. You can even add an icon to the button to make it look more professional and eye-catching. After you add the book description, the mock-up image of the book, and properly set up the buy button, if we scroll down a little, we can add some images from inside the book itself. For example, I want to replace this image with a picture of a girl holding our book. And here, we can write more descriptions and details about the book, explaining exactly how the child will benefit from it and what makes this book special. And so the video doesn't get too long, you'll continue scrolling down and replace all these images with real examples from inside your book. This way, the buyer can clearly see what they're getting before they purchase the book. Now, if we scroll down even more, you'll find a very powerful section that I personally always include on my websites, the Frequently Asked Questions section. You can edit this section however you like. For example, for the first question, we can write, Can I resell this book? And the answer depends on whether you're offering PLR rights or not. And I always recommend that you offer resale rights because it significantly increases your sales. You can then modify all the questions below however you want. And you can also delete any questions you don't need very easily. And if we scroll down a little more, for example, if you're selling Canva templates or PDF files, you can place the logos of the platforms you rely on for your designs and where your files are created. And don't worry, very soon we'll explain exactly how to sell Canva templates because honestly, it's one of the best things you can sell right now and it's generating thousands of dollars every single day. And if you want to remove this entire section, you can do that very easily as well. Now here at the bottom, I strongly recommend that you add the names of other products you sell on your website to increase your sales. For example, if a mom likes one book, she'll naturally want to see what else you're selling, and that increases the chance she'll buy more than one product. So always add your other products down here and don't forget to link each product to its own sales page. I also recommend that you always offer something for free on your sales page. For example, you can design 10 math worksheets and offer them for free to moms here. On this button, you can write something like download now then link it to those free pages. You can upload those files to Google Drive and connect the link right here. And if we scroll down, you can also edit and connect your social media accounts to this website so they appear clearly to the buyer and help you grow your followers. Followers who will buy from you again and again. And once you finish the entire website, you'll realize how easy this process really is. It won't take you more than 30 minutes to build a very professional sales page. And when you're done, just click Save right here. Now I'll click to exit this page. And we'll move on to the second page, which is the order form page. This is the payment page. And as usual, we select any template from the available pages. For example, I'll choose this page and name it the same as our book. If we scroll down a little, You'll notice that you can set up an affiliate program for the product you're selling. This is an amazing feature that I haven't seen on many other platforms. Next, let's move on to edit the payment page settings on the left panel. Since our product is a digital product, I'll delete all the fields related to shipping information. We can just keep the email field, so we collect customer emails to send them other products later. This is called email marketing, 
and it's one of the most powerful forms of marketing, which this platform supports really well. You'll see in a moment that you can edit anything on this page exactly how you want. But for now, I'll leave it as it is, and then click Save and Exit. Now, let's move on to the final page, which is the Thank You page. This page appears to the customer after the payment is completed. You can choose any template from the ready-made options, and here you can write a thank you message to your customer or even suggest another product. On this button, you'll add the link to download your book. I recommend uploading the book to Google Drive and placing the link here, so when the buyer completes the payment, they can download the book instantly. Now, if we exit and look at the website we built, you'll see that when we click the Buy button, nothing happens yet. What you need to do is go back to the Order Form page, copy the link of that page, then return to the first page, the Product page, and paste that link into the Buy Now button. Then just save it. Now, let's check the website again. If we click Buy Now, it will redirect us to the order page. But the price won't appear yet because I haven't connected my PayPal account. To set the price for your book, go back to the order form page. Choose that this product is digital, click the plus icon, and write the product name here. Under Resources, if you have an email marketing campaign on this platform and want to send emails to your buyers to encourage them to purchase other products, you can select the campaign by clicking on Tags and choosing the campaign name. And at the bottom, you can set the product price. But remember, you must first connect your payment methods in order to add a price for your product. Now if you notice at the top, there's a button called Automation Rule. If we click on it and then click the Trigger button, let's choose New Sale. Next, go to the Action section on the right and select Send Email. In short, this tool is amazing. You're basically telling the platform that whenever someone purchases this product, it should automatically send them an email. You can include the product link in this email, and you can also let them know about a discount if they buy another product, which can significantly increase your sales. Email marketing like this is incredibly powerful. All you need to do is click the plus icon next to the email then, write the email details you want to send to buyers of this product. You can even attach a PDF to the email. This way, you can send the book directly to the customer immediately after they pay. And don't worry, all of this happens automatically, without any manual effort from you. And now, we're approaching the final part. If we go to the Email page and click on Campaigns, you can create an email campaign and send it automatically to everyone who has purchased your products. Honestly, I think this is one of the best features of this platform because it can dramatically increase your sales. Just enter your personal details here, write the email you want to send, and don't forget to link your domain so the buyer knows it's an official email from you. And with that, we've completed this video. I truly consider this one of the most important videos for anyone selling digital products. In the end, I want to tell you to stay consistent and keep going until you achieve strong results. You'll find all the links I used listed down in the description. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in another tutorial very soon. Goodbye for now.